what's going to be first, men? Wine, women, or song? Decisions, decisions. <laughs> now, play that, men. You know the being from that door is for everybody to stay on board. Oh, let Bottom and the Skipper be negotiating that treaty with the Shah Durrani for hours. Yeah, he'll never know we're gone. Mm -hmm. Now, wait a minute, man. I'm sorry, but orders are orders. Hey, if you want to have fun, why don't we play cards? How about a game of old maid? Oh, brother. <laughs> hey, Mr. Parker, why waste time with games? As long as we're stuck on board, how about putting the time to good use? Say, with a, a blackout drill. Blackout drill? You're a How can you have a blackout drill in broad daylight? Now, how about that, group? What's the use of trying to tell these ignoramuses, Mr. Parker? We gotta show them. Now, here. First, we adjust the hanky over the arm. <clears throat> there. Now then, gentlemen, the object of a blackout drill is to be completely blindfolded and still be able to identify all <laughs> objects by touch alone. Right, Mr. Parker? Huh? Hey, yeah. now I get it. Great idea, Groove. <laughs> hey, yeah. Yeah. All right, guys, uh, <clears throat> stand back and let an expert handle it. <laughs> uh, I got uh, fingers like, or eyes like a bat. <laughs> uh, now, man, uh, follow me right over All right, now, uh, boys, do uh, <clears throat> you want to just follow me over this way? Now, over here, we have the uh, radar map. Yeah, uh, well, that's funny. He was here this morning. Uh, we've taken a wrong turn. Uh, let's uh, wander back this way. Uh, the radar man. Oh, here it is. I, got... I found it. Found it. Radar man. Oh, sorry, Gruber. Uh, you want to straighten your tie? So if. Oh. Uh, boys, you want to stand back? I, I can't work if I'm going to be tripping over your feet. Uh, we're going to be going up two steps to the forward deck, so uh, watch yourself. Uh, right up this way, boys. Uh, now watch your step, boys. There's a uh, two-step right there. And we're going to... Uh, okay. Who's the wise guy to let the sea bags around here? Boys, it's going to have to be cleaned up. Now, oh. Uh, oh, here we are. Uh, this is the wheel. Uh, very important part of the, the boat. See, it goes left or right. And the boys may get a chance at it on the way home. And, uh, here is, oh, here's the forward railing. <coughs> hey, seagull at 2 o'clock. Uh, how about that? Really hot today. <laughs> I'm going with the boys, uh, stay with them. Oh, uh, hey, whoo! Hey, the depth charge overboard? <laughs> hey, <laughs> Oh, boy. Uh, all right, here, let me help you up, Willie. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. You saved me. Uh, now, look, Willie, don't get hysterical at a time like this. you got to be a man. All right, boys, it looked like it was a dud, so we, uh... Say, uh, Willie, I don't want to say anything in front of the other guys, but you're a little out of shape. <laughs> Who is this Willie, and, and why are you blindfolded? What do you mean, why am I blindfolded? We were... Hey, you're a girl. What are you doing on our boat? Look, where is our boat? Hey, one of the guys. I do not know who you are, monsieur, but I thank you. A thousand times I thank you. Well, you're welcome. For what? Well, that man, he was trying to rob me and choke me, and, and you saved me. How can I thank you? Well... You shouldn't have done that. Why, why, we haven't even... Boy, it's lucky the guys are below. Why, we haven't even been introduced. <laughs> yes, forgive me. I'm Karema, a daughter to the Shah of Durrani. Oh, uh, well, I'm Charles. <laughs> uh, son to the mother, uh, Mrs. Parker of Chagrin Falls. <laughs> the Shah of Durrani. Hey, we're here to sign a treaty with him. Well, why, that almost makes us pen pals. I would love for him to meet you. Please come, the hotel is close by. Oh, uh, well, uh, oh, I don't know, though, uh... Of course, it is kind of in the line of duty. Well, all right, you guys, stay below and watch the boat. <laughs> Great bunch of guys. Got to keep your eye on them at all times, though. <laughs> and, and remember what the Admiral said, that the getting those oil rights is real vital, sir. Oh, big deal. Big deal. Yes, sir. I want to tell you, Mikhail, I'm the, he, I'm the highest ranking <laughs> officer in this area. Yes. And I don't have to take this guff from some cockamamie, two-bit character just because he happens to own an island that has oil on it. Yes. His Highness, the Shah of Durrani. Oh, 
Oh, your highness. I'm, I'm so honored, your highness. This is the greatest day of my life. <laughs> Who is this uniformed cocker spaniel? Oh, well, well, sir, I gave you begging your uh, highness's pardon, sir, but I'm Lieutenant Commander McHale, and this is... Uh, I'm, I'm Cocker Bingham. Uh, cocker Bingham. No, no, I'm Captain I'm Bingham. Captain. And we bring you the warm felicitations of the American Navy. Yes, well, thank you. Thank you very much. Where is the admiral? Uh, well, Admiral Rogers uh, sent his regrets, sir, but uh, he was tied up with important matters at Comfrey, and so he sent us to negotiate for him. Uh, uh, he, he did not send us. Sent me. Sent me, Your Highness. Me. You see, uh, you must excuse him. He's a very uncouth peasant, and you know how they are. They're always trying to elbow their way in with us dignitaries. <laughs> now, I have a rough draft of the treaty right here, I'm Your sorry. It's an insult to think that I would even negotiate one treaty without at least an admiral in attendance. Uh, but, but, sir, Admiral Rogers did send his apologies, and it was just nobody else, sir. No, no, wait a minute. Wait a minute. You see, in an emergency like this, and this is an emergency, we could arrange for a field promotion. Field promotion? Yes, yes, yes. We call Comfleet, and you tell them that you want me promoted to Admiral, and then I'll be Admiral Binghamton. Well, I can't be bothered with all this nonsense. The answer is still no. Oh, Your Majesty, Your Majesty, please, 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 wait. Now, you want to have an Admiral, sire. I don't want to be an Admiral, so have them make me an Admiral, and we'll all be happy. <laughs> Oh. Daughter, what has happened? Are you all right? I'm fine, Father, thanks to this brave young ensign. Oh, so I'm... brave young ensign, I'll break every bone in his body. Get me off the deck. I'm not both there. Set him down. Easy, Captain, easy, easy, easy. It is a pleasure to meet you, young man. Oh, um, well, it's a pleasure to meet you, your Shaughness. <laughs> uh, oh, uh, no, no, I know. Uh, face East uh, learned this in high school. Well, uh, we're honored to... Wait a minute. That's Southwest. Uh, <laughs> now, if the sun rises over here... Uh, uh, Chuck, Chuck, Chuck. Uh, it's okay, Chuck. I'm sure His Highness appreciates your words of welcome. Just don't pay any attention to him at all, your Highness. He happens to be the dumbest, clumsiest klutz in the whole U.S. Navy. How dare you call Charles such terrible names? Why, well, he saved my life. Did I hear you say he saved your life? Yes, Father. I was accosted by an ugly brute down by the docks, and, and this dear, sweet ensign came to my rescue. Hey, how about that? Hey, Captain, did you hear that? Why, I, Ensign Parker's a hero. <laughs> I want to thank you with all my heart, young man. Permit me to reward you in some way. Oh, Pshaw, sure, Shaw. Sure. After all, she already kissed me. <laughs> uh, the, the, the treaty. <laughs> we were discussing a little matter of a, a field promotion. Very well, Captain. You handle the details. And when you're ready, summon me. Ah, oh, Your Highness. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Mm. I can't tell you how happy I am that you've made me an admiral. No, oh, Captain, you're mistaken. I'm not making you an admiral. I'm making him an admiral. <laughs> I just said that. Me, an admiral? No, 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 Your Highness, please, it's not him. Don't you understand? It's me, it's me, it's me. He doesn't deserve it. I'm the one that deserves it. The man is a boob. He's a boob. Enough. I have spoken. I will not sign the treaty with anyone but Admiral Parker. <laughs> Child. Oh, I give. I well, I, I guess we better call Comfleet about Mr. Parker's promotion, huh, sir? No. No, 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 no. That's all right, sir. If you want to go ahead and scream, just go right ahead. <laughs> what? Make Parker an admiral? That's insane. It does sound that way, doesn't it, sir? But uh, uh, the Shah said he'll negotiate only with an admiral, sir. And, and since you can't be here... Why... But why Parker, that bird brain? Well, you see, the Shah has taken a liking to the bird brain. I mean, Mr. Parker, sir. And, uh, well, he insists he'll only negotiate with Admiral Parker. Of course, the Pentagon did say they wanted those oil rights at any cost. So you'll, you'll authorize the promotion, sir? Oh, no, 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 no. He'll never do it. Please, don't let him do it. All right, I'll issue an order making Parker temporary admiral. But it will only be in effect until the split second that treaty is signed. All right, sir. Bye-bye. Bye. Son of a gun. Well, it's official, Chuck. You're being promoted to Admiral. You let him. <laughs> Admiral Parker. Wow. Oh, boy. Hey, did you hear that, Captain? Hey, now I can give you orders. <laughs> well, this can't be happening to me. This is going to be a horrible nightmare. Well, then, uh, Admiral Rogers says that this promotion is only in effect until the treaty is signed. Hey, Dad. 
Well, and that's what I gotta do. I gotta get the shot to sign that treaty. <laughs> You're not gonna be an admiral long. Oh, you, you, you. A thousand apologies, sir. Why don't you watch where you're going, you stupid? I was, you, you oh, oh, you're the uh, uh, sahib, but, uh, or however you, uh, uh, I, uh, could you summon the Shah? Uh, that is impossible, sir. His Highness has been called back to Durrani on urgent business. The signing of the treaty must be postponed. Uh, uh, postponed? For how long? His Highness will come to Teratupa to finalize the treaty with Admiral Parker within 48 hours. Until then, good fortune to you all. I uh, said to you with the good and all of it. I can't go back to Teratupa and be outranked by this stupid klutz. That's Admiral Klutz to you. You better watch it. I got a trigger temper. I'd hate to put you on report. Put me on report? Oh, that doesn't. Oh, I've taken all I'm going to take from this. No, 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 All secure, Admiral. I'll stop with that Admiral business. Get out of my way. Admiral first. <laughs> you all right, Captain? I'm all right. Listen to me, Parker. You're only an Admiral till that Shaw gets here and signs that treaty. And when he dies, you're going to be an ensign again. And when you're an ensign, I'm going to break you into 50,000 pieces. <laughs> oh, that goes the rest of your cutthroats, too. We'll see you at the last laugh around here. Bye, Captain. Bye. Boy, he sure hates to see anybody get ahead in this world. Yeah, I'm just trying to stay out of old Lead Bottom's way until after that treaty's signed. And the rest of you guys, sit tight. Stay on the boat. I gotta go over and radio a full report to Admiral Rogers. Sit tight. Boy, Mr. Parker, it's too bad you're not really an admiral. Yeah, you wouldn't have to take all that guff from Binghamton. Neither would we. Ah, that creep. Yeah, boy, if I was a real admiral, you can bet your bottom dollar I wouldn't... Hey, wait a minute. I am a real admiral. Uh, I mean, for today, anyway. Well, now, wait a minute, Mr. Parker. We were just talking no, about No, wait that. a minute. I'm taking enough from that measly captain. I'll show him. As you were, man. <clears throat> or, uh, stay here. Whatever they say. <laughs> Mr. Parker, wait! The skip says to stay right here. Where are you going? Tell the skip I'll be in my office. What office? You don't have an office. I will have as soon as I throw Binghamton out of his. Push me around, Willie. <laughs> Fuji was here, you know what he'd say. Boy, hey. <laughs> Parker, what are you doing in my office? Why, 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 why? Well, I was just about to ask you the same thing. Well, it isn't exactly what I had in mind, but it's livable. Here. Now, look, uh, why don't you get your grubby possessions and get out of here, Leadbottom? Why, oh, you stupid nitwit. Admiral stupid. Am I a... Oh, boy. Now, look what you've done. All right. Now, get a mop and clean that up. And I mean hop to it. Oh, if you think for one minute that I'm going to get a mop and... Now, look here. I said get a mop or, or, or I'm going to hang you from the highest yard bird. Arm, arm. I'm going to have to... Now, this is your admiral speaking. All right, now get a mop. Hop to it. Hop, hop, hop. You're not hopping. Hop, hop. All right, here. Captain, I was down briefing on a new SP unit. I heard you were back and I wanted to hear what... Uh... Parker, what are you doing in that admiral's uniform? I'm practicing for a performance of pinafore. Oh, what do you think I'm doing in it, you ninny? You're a ninny. Ninny, ninny, ninny. <laughs> Captain Binghamton, sir! Come quickly! Captain Binghamton! Go on me with you. Come quickly! Captain! Go. Captain! Oh, there you are, sir. Sir, I caught him impersonating an admiral. Sir, what are you doing with that? I'm impersonating Cinderella. Let go of the admiral. You mean he really is an admiral? I really is an admiral. Oh, oh, Admiral, I didn't know, sir. Believe me, I didn't know. I am terribly sorry. Are you all right? Forgive me, please. Would you stop drooling over him? You better stop mopping. Mop, mop, mop. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. You can't make me do it. You're only an Admiral. The Shah signs that treaty, and that won't be long. Yeah, but it only takes a minute to make out a man's transfer to combat duty. <clears throat> right, Lieutenant? Oh, yeah, so would you please call me Elroy? Elroy? Yes, sir. and you are right. If you would like me to, I will cut Captain Binghamton's orders. Wait a minute, I'm mopping, I'm mopping. All right, and you keep mopping. Now I want both of you to clean up this office. I'm going out and inspect my base. And when I get back, I better be spick and span. Do you hear me? Spick and span. Get the door. Yes, sir. That's strange. I'm mopping. I'm mopping. <laughs> But this isn't fair, sir. Admiral Parker distinctly told us both to clean well, up. Well, shut up. One more Admiral Parker out of you, and I'll give oh, you a good oh, look. Oh, excuse me. Captain, for the love of... Captain, what are you doing with that swab? 
Carpy, how dare you? <laughs> but Admiral Parker told us to clean up, both of us. Oh, don't be silly. He was only joking. <laughs> you know that. By the way, uh, where is Mr. Parker? How should I know? He said he's going out to inspect the base. Any luck at all, he may run into a minefield. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one, a minefield, yes, sir. <laughs> well, sir, the, the reason I came over is, uh, well, you see, the, um, the Shah of Durrani will be landing in, in less than an hour, sir. And uh, if you uh, see Mr. Parker, would you please tell him to come to the officer's club uh, right away, uh, uh, sir? Uh, Bye-bye, Captain. <laughs> Bye. Did you hear him, sir? The Shah is arriving to sign the treaty. Then Parker will be an ensign again, and you can get your revenge. Oh, I am so happy for you, sir. Will you shut up, you turncoat, you. <laughs> How can I be happy? Parker's gonna get all the glory. Why couldn't it be me instead of him? Oh, when I think of all the years I've waited to put this on, there was just some way I... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. There is a way. Yeah. Uh, get me SP headquarters. SP headquarters? Sir, what are you going to do? I'm going to put on this admiral uniform, and I'm going to negotiate with the Shah. But, sir, you could be arrested for, for imitating an admiral. Yes, yeah, well, you've got the right idea. you got the wrong admiral. Uh, hello, SP headquarters. This is your captain speaking. And now you hear this. There is an ensign on this base masquerading as an admiral. I want you to pick him up and lock him up. And, and be careful with him, because the man is an absolute kook. Over and out. But, sir, the Shah is expecting to meet with Admiral Parker. So he'll meet with Admiral Binghamton. I'll get him to sign the treaty. Comfleet won't care how I did it, and I'll be a hero. Oh, sir, if I may say so, you are a genius. An absolute genius. I have never so been with a man. the bouncing boob is back on my side again. Now you stop sniveling and close your but eyes. But, sir, you Close your eyes. I'm dressing. You in there? Oh, yes, sir, yes, sir. Don't peek. <laughs> Where is he, Skip? Hey, to find Mr. Parker. No, doggone it. Old Leadbottom said he went off to inspect the base yet. Oh, great. That means he could be any place. Well, he was acting. He might be down ordering his own battleship. Oh, <laughs> cut it out, will you, you bunch of gloomy gusses. Now, look, we got to find him and fast before the Shah gets here. So, come on, spread out. <laughs> uh, okay, fellas, uh, everything is Shaw-shaped for the ship. <laughs> or, uh, ship Shaw for the... It's okay. <laughs> What well, is being an admiral can sure run a guy down. <laughs> Fellas? <laughs> Here. Hey, I think I'll take a little nap. Young admirals need their rest. <laughs> The cook that's masquerading as the admiral. Let's get him. <laughs> All right, fella, you're under arrest. How dare you? I'm Admiral Rogers. Sure you are. Down here from Comfleet to help finalize a treaty with the Shah of Durrani. Sure, sure, and I just came from Never Never Land from seeing the Queen of the May. Come on! <laughs> Some of the guys are back. Doggone it. I guess they couldn't find him either. And that Shaw's plane is going to sit down any minute. How are we going to feel Mr. Parker out of this one, Skip? Well, what are you asking me for? I don't know. All I know is that the Shah refused to sign unless there's an admiral present. And if we blow those oil treaties because of... Hey, wait a minute. I think I got it. Hey, group, they have admiral's uniforms over special services, haven't they? Sure, but... Hey, Skip, you mean you're going to dress up as an admiral and meet the Shah? No, 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 no. The Shah knows me, but he's never met Admiral Gruber. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> admiral Gruber? I guess I owe it all a clean living. <laughs> you come on. The coast is clear, sir. Good. Now you get down to the airstrip and you pick up his highness. Bring him back here. Yes, sir. Oh, sir, if I may say so, you make a magnificent admiral. Oh, oh I do sort of have a little uh -huh. bit. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Get moving. Announcing the Shah of Durrani. 
Oh, your highness, princess, welcome to Taratupa. I thought it was clearly understood that I would negotiate this treaty only with Admiral Parker. Oh, Parker. Well, Parker has been called away on, on Navy business, at the war, you know. She, another day, another battle. <laughs> I think if you come right down here, sir, you'll find everything in order right here. Uh, excuse me, Prince. Uh, Your Highness, uh, Princess, uh, uh, it's most unfortunate to say that uh, uh, Admiral Parker will be detained, you see. And... At ease, Commander. The Shah knows all about Parker being detained. Oh, Captain Binghamton, did you? Admiral Binghamton. Uh, sorry, Your Highness. Uh, sorry, Princess. Uh, I'm sorry for intruding. Uh, I'll, I'll, be, I'll be on my way now. Uh, out of my way, Commander. I'm in a hurry. I've got two parades and an invasion to make before lunch. No, 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 Commission Red. Uh, Your Highnesses, I am Admiral Gruber. And since your good friend Admiral Parker could not be here to sign the treaty, I... Uh... Gruber. Uh-oh. Uh, Hi-ho, sir. Nice day for a treaty, eh? What? Another Admiral. I, uh, Mikhail. Uh, that, uh, uh, excuse me, Your Highness, while I introduce uh, the Admirals to each other. <clears throat> uh, Admiral? So, sir, sir, the most important thing right now is to get that treaty signed and fast. And let this two-bit phony hog the limelight not in a million years. Skip. Look. <laughs> Your Royal Dignitary Ship, Admiral Bell here in place of Admiral Parker, who was unavoidably detained. Admiral Bell? What kind of navy is this? Is everyone an admiral? Only in America, Father. Perhaps I can explain, sir. You yeah, see... You won't explain anything. I'm in oh, charge here. I'll explain. It's all too confusing for me, dear. Let's go. Sir, sir. Admiral Parker. Yes. Hi, Princess. Uh, hi, Shaw. Oh, uh... uh no, that won't oh, be no. necessary. Gee, I'm sorry. I'm a little late, but I was taking a nap, so I could... Hey, Tinker. Hey, you guys made Admiral Groove. Boy, that's great. Wow. Hey, let... Lead bottom. Gee, you're taking anybody. Well, this is all very confusing, but as long as you're here, Admiral Parker, I believe I will sign. Oh, no, 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 Shaw. You, you've got to sign it with me. You see, I'm, I'm a Captain Admiral. He's just an Ensign Admiral. Oh, you just got promoted. Why, next to me, you're a Baby Admiral. A baby Admiral? You dodo, I've taken about all from you. I'm going to take her. Please, 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 sir, you're making it look bad for the rest of us, Admiral. Now, let us get out of this madhouse. What in places is going He's out of my way? Admiral Rogers, a ten hut! Admiral Ro Your Admiral Rogers? But I don't understand this. Four admirals standing at attention for a common prisoner? Uh, well, you see, uh, I uh, am uh, not... You see, Your Highness, uh, the, uh, don't let the uniform fool you, sir. Uh, this is really Admiral Rogers. He's been out on a mission, uh, an undercover mission. Isn't that right, Admiral? You're absolutely right, Mikhail. And you see, uh, Your Highness, uh, we felt that the Shah of Durrani was much too important to be greeted by only one admiral. So we uh, uh, had all the admirals in the area uh, come in. <laughs> Isn't that right, gentlemen? Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> yes. uh, at the Treaty of Versailles, there were only two admirals present. Ah, uh, but for our treaty with you... <laughs> Six? <laughs> well... This is an honor I could hardly refuse. Yes, I, I will sign the treaty. Ah, uh, good. He'll sign the good. treaty. Oh, good. He's going to uh, I'm first. First. Oh, uh, the second. Father. Uh, Parker. Third. Third. I'm third. Fourth. Fifth. Fifth. Is there any room? I'm fifth. Fourth. Gentlemen, gentlemen, may I propose a toast? To our favorite executive officer, welcome back to the ranks, Ensign Parker. Yeah. 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 Oh, it's great to be back, you guys. I never want to see another admiral as long as I live. Yeah, yeah. 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 I agree to that. <laughs> hey, how about some chow? Forge, oh. bring on the chow. The name is Admiral Fujiyama to you. <laughs> First, men, wine, women, a song. Decisions, decisions. <laughs> now, play that, men. You know the fan from that door is for everybody to stay on board. Oh, let Bottom and the Skipper be negotiating that treaty with the Shah Durrani for hours. Yeah, he'll never know we're gone. Mm -hmm. Now, wait a minute, man. I'm sorry, but orders are orders. Hey, if you want to have fun, why don't we play cards? How about a game of old maid? Oh, brother. <laughs> hey, Mr. Parker, why waste time with games? As long as we're stuck on board, 
How about putting the time to good use? Say, with a, a blackout drill. Blackout drill? You're flat, Blaster. How can you have a blackout drill in broad daylight? Uh, how about that group? What's the use of trying to tell these ignoramuses, Mr. Parker? We got to show them. Now, here. First, we adjust the hanky over the arm. <clears throat> there. Now then, gentlemen, the object of a blackout drill is to be completely blindfolded and still be able to identify all <laughs> objects by touch alone. Right, Mr. Parker? Huh? Hey, yeah. now I get it. Hey, great idea, Groove. Hey, yeah. Yeah. All right, guys, uh, <clears throat> stand back and let an expert handle it. <laughs> uh, I got uh, fingers like, or eyes like a bat. <laughs> uh, now, man, uh, follow me right over All right, now, uh, boys, uh, <clears throat> you want to just follow me over this way? Now, over here, we have a uh, radar map. Yeah, uh... Well, that's funny. He was here this morning. Uh, we've taken a wrong turn. Uh, let's uh, wander back this way. Uh, the radar man. Oh, here it is. I, got... I found it. Found it. Radar man. Oh, sorry, Gruber. Uh, you want to straighten your tie? So if. Uh, boys, you want to stand back? I, I can't work if I'm going to be tripping over your feet. <laughs> up two steps to the forward deck so uh watch yourself uh right up this way boys uh, now watch your step boys there's a uh, two-step right there and we're going to uh, okay who's the wise guy to let the sea bags around here boys it's gonna have to be cleaned up now oh uh oh here we are uh 